Softplan has instituted a new graphic interface for the wall definition menu. For this example, we will open the wall definition menu from the project options. Upon editing the wall and beam selection list, we can select the wall for modification. Located on the left side of the wall definition dialog are a series of commands including cursor snap, cursor lock, edit item, move, adjust item, item erase, undo, and redo. These tools can be used in conjunction with the graphic dialog below to build or modify your wall definitions. For this example, we will remove the existing siding on the wall through item erase. Upon clicking on the material within the section of the wall definition menu, it will also be removed from the list of materials. Next, using the move command, the brick sill can be moved on the wall definition menu vertically up. Softplan will update the vertical dimension for the new brick placement. Next, using adjust item, we can adjust the brick A portion of the wall definition menu up to meet the underside of the brick sill. Of course, the dimensions can be modified to meet specific standards. So in this case, we can modify the vertical start point for the brick B at 54 inches and modify the height for brick A to match as well. Finally, we will use the add material option to insert a board and batten siding. With the siding added, we can enable the cursor snap. Then, using adjust item, adjust the overall height of the siding to match where the top of the brick sill is. Finally, using the move item command in conjunction with the cursor snap, we can properly place the board and batten siding. And that's it. This new graphic interface with tools such as move, adjust item, item erase, and cursor snap in conjunction with the ability to modify dimensions should enhance the wall definition process.